I just wanted to offer something back to revive this area because so much goes on down the road um, in Brighton and I don't think there's enough going on here. Talking about community, we basically are the community. We are the, community, we? We are yes. the neighbours. And um, yeah, we live down the road and we've watched this, this path. Oh, I don't know. I've lived here 14 years, so we've watched it come and go and different things come and go. So it's very exciting to have something new. Um, we've all got small children who love playing down here. So for us, it's, it's a godsend, isn't it? It's nice and light and nice and airy, isn't it? It's quite a few windows. Yeah. It's fantastic having this. We were expressing doubts about whether our children would like vegan food because they're not normally used to it. And this is a very kids orientated area. So if the kids didn't like the food, but the acid test today was whether the kids and there's a whole lot of empty plates over there, which means the kids like it. I'm sure it's going to be very popular. I think it's a very good thing. It would be really nice if this is um, successful. I don't think Hover's had something like this before. Good first impression, yeah. You can, you can tell by the turnout today actually that everyone's having a great time, it's, it's tremendous support. So I think it does, it fulfills the need that there is. I love the sauces. I do hope it's a big success. Yeah. <laughs> well, you know, I've been in, in Brighton on and off for 40 years, but so I've never even been down to this park before. So I hope this cafe attracts a new crowd down to this area. It's good for, on her that she's, um, she recognises that there's a need for something like this. Recommend them. The chips taste much nicer than normal ones because they're not like fatty or yeah, they're really nice. It's very hard to say no. Listen, well done, really fancy. So, uh, two Indian, two Mexican, right. two Thai, two Italian. What, and two what, Indian. Is, what does Madam recommend? You can be funky in here, but it's sexy. It's good for your health, you want to lose some pounds. It's good for the environment, it's fantastic for the animals and it's the way that we can save the planet all together even if you just do one day a week. I just want everyone to congregate together because in this day and age, the sense of community is just disappearing day by day. You know, people get used to, I suppose, what you'd call celebrity names and celebrity chefs like Jamie Oliver's place, charging an awful lot of money for fairly everyday food in some cases, whereas here it's accessible so people on normal salaries can enjoy it and they can come along and, and bring their kids. It's completely family friendly, you can bring your dogs, it's dog friendly. It's surrounded by all this fantastic stuff going on, skateboard park and the kids park. So it's really obvious that everybody's welcome and yet inside it's got class as well. So it's that unusual combination of being very family friendly but classy as well. Really nice. So good. It's a very good place with a skate park to attract skateboarders and it's very good with the conveyor belt. I like the conveyor belt. I liked it. It was like different nice. <laughs> it all went downhill when the calf went and then it's going back up to the bee bars.